Linger for noobs. Hello, this is Dan Knowles and welcome to Blender for Noobs. In this video we're going to be looking at downloading the Blender program. And uh, it may seem pretty easy, but if you're just starting out with Blender you may not know how to do it, so let's take a look. What you do is just go to www.blender.org and it'll bring up this page here. And you want to go to the download link up here. So I'm going to click that. And you'll see the latest version that you have with Blender. And you also see some um, daily SVN snapshots of the daily builds from Blender. Um, and those, of course, are for if you want to get the very latest that they aren't really uh, checked out to make sure that it's bug free and all that good stuff. So uh, if we look at our version right now, it's 2.66a. And depending on what operating system you have, of course, you'll choose that. For me, I'm going to choose Windows 64-bit, and I'm going to choose the installer file. And I'm going to come down here to the USA link since I currently reside in the USA. So then it'll tell you that it's going to begin momentarily, and then it pops up and you save the file. Okay, so once you have it downloaded, then in my case, since I'm using Firefox, I just uh, I go to the containing folder, find the file, and since I'm using Windows 7, I'm going to run as administrator, and just run the file. And I'm going to choose Next, and agree to their license agreement, and I'm just going to go with the defaults here. And I usually leave the destination folder as it is and click install. And that's pretty much it. It starts installing. I'm going to show details just to get, give an idea of what it's doing at the time. Right now it's extracting files. It's going to extract all these files and it's going to start installing them. Okay, so once it's finished, it's automatically set to run. So I'm going to go ahead and run it. Just make sure that everything's okay. Now, if you have installed Blender before, then if you already have installed, what you want to do is do a copy previous settings, and that will keep your set the setup that you have for Blender. If it's a new new install, of course, you won't see that option, or if you do, you won't have any any uh, previous settings copy. So I'm going to do that. So right away, it comes up with the setting the setup that I had. And if you want to check your version, you can all always go to help and show the splash screen here. And that'll give you 2.66a and the release number, which is more detail of that specific version. So that's it. That's the installation of Blender. In the next video, what we're going to look at is going through the setup and how you get some of these windows set up the way you want. So I'll see you then. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and all that good stuff. Talk to you later.